when one says um, there should be equality, it means you, you, every, everything is the same. But of course that's not quite so uh, reflective of a certain situation because nobody is the same. So therefore we need to practice equity. Equality is when you are given access to different resources, different privileges, um, but without looking at the overall effect, without actually observing that there are pre-existing obstacles that are faced with each individual employee. Equity, on the other hand, is, um, is, is also providing not the same, but specific and related relevant resources um, to cater for an individual's needs and um, demands, their strengths and their weaknesses particularly. So when you combine um, equity and equality, then you, would say, then you can actually say that you've achieved true fairness. The DEI programs are essential to, to be established to ensure that there's um, a workplace that's equitable, um, a workplace that is conducive to productive work by all. Each um, employee needs to be appreciated, you know, each employee needs to be respected, to be recognised for his or her contribution, because I think there's nothing more important than having a good, um, happy, healthy um, workforce in a company, because that drives you, that's the driving force of any, of any business. We've established GWEN, which is Gamuda Women Empowerment Networking, and I think that gives the support to women. So and this is to ensure that the woman is, is not alone and that she's supported at every step of the way. Um, equally, we also have the Enabling Academy. The Enabling Academy, as you know, is um, trying to we focus on young adults with autism, autism um, with a slightly higher spectrum. They've achieved so much under the training that the Enabling Academy through the education training yeah. programs. So I think with the Enabling program, we have seen that um, it, has, it has worked quite well. For the majority of the cases that we have, um, we've seen you know, that they've, they've become productive. With the DI, it gives us that flexibility and that insight to look into people power, you know, to look into what is it that you, that you need. So it gives you, it gives you the ability to recruit the right kind of skills for the right kind of situation that you need. To recruit that, you need to have a wider demographic, you know, you need to have a wider workforce to choose from. So that the research has shown that, that having inclusive teams um, can improve the performance by 30%. That's huge. So you, you become more productive, you become more efficient. As long as there are movements in that direction, as long as there's that recognition and awareness, and maybe even if it's one or two cases that has, you know, has actually recognized and bridged that gap, I think we're, we're making progress recognizing that you know different gender has got different contributions different strengths different weaknesses but combined it gives you that extra strength work towards that you know then i feel that it's 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 you know we we can we can actually say that you know we've left a legacy for our children um, to to step on that platform and then you know rise from there we've um, demonstrated in many ways that We've always considered a win-win-win situation. The workforce is our core asset. Without the assets, Gamuda can't grow or can't perform. Together, we embrace equality and equity, and inshallah, we will go much further. So in, in conjunction with the International Women's Day 2023, um, I would like to take this opportunity to congratulate the employees um, the women um, in Gamuda for their contribution and their participation and their efforts. Um, um, but at the same time, I also like to congratulate and celebrate the men, uh, the male workforce in Gamuda as well, because I think without them, um, the, the women in this, um, in this company cannot 
proceed as, as well as they do. Behind every successful woman is a, is a strong, dedicated, supportive man. It's all the very best for the men and women um, of this company and um, we've gone, you know, we've, we've, we've progressed um, a lot in the last years despite challenges um, um, in the last two years. But yes, that's very encouraging for the future. All the best. Thank you.